So you talk about easy admin. So this is easy admin. This is gonna pop up when you if you don't the installation right and everything right. This is how it's gonna pop up for you. So uh, let's start with the simple installations. So we have here the dashboard. This is where all your main server stuff will be here. Uh, the players and performance chat will be available in hours, so it's not here yet. Uh, you can see here like the server sync network, everything has is handling going well. Status, uh, your Discord by status is available because you don't have a bot. Server status is online. Next restart is uh, we can schedule a restart here and like for example Sarah uh gonna restart at like uh, 3 p.m for example or 3 p.m 9 something like that wherever you want you're gonna restart in an hour uh, and you can call so that this is temporary the schedule restart is temporary uh this one is that when you press on this one is temporary so if you cancel that and uh, we'll talk about the schedule restart in, in soon so this announce if you want to send announcement in the server is going to pop up in a uh, great uh, big like uh, yellow box saying your name announce etc start stop and re restart restart and stop just do like start start stop your server of course uh, and you don't need anything else here it's just your just the theme if you want so players now we have only one player which is me here uh this is gonna show you total playtime of every single player or well, how many white lists if you white listing uh, warns and bans you can uh, ban people by their ids team discord etc here for any good reason and you put uh duration so we go to the live console live console will give you everything as is happening on your server so for example let's say you can do, it, for example, this say something. It will post something on the uh, your chat. For example, uh, if you say I don't know, like ensure chat or start chat or uh, that was doesn't work. Sorry, start this or stop chat. So it's gonna stop chat. If you ensure, ch I mean, start chat. Now it's gonna work. If you ensure that, that is going to restart the resource. Okay, we're done with the live console. Uh, here we have the all resources. So here you can see all the resources. This default resources is gonna, it's automatically hide, but if you press them, you don't have any other resources. But if you press it, you can see the rest, uh, the default resources that SFX has. It's all these. And yeah. This press on this is gonna show you stop resources. So if you press on these both, it's gonna show you stop effect resources, which are these. Anyway, we pass to server log. Server log is this is gonna log everything that happens. You can log filter the logs by what you want. For example, player death, menu actions, easy menu actions, explosions, commands, system events, etc. You can view older your yesterdays. Or today's, you can clear the console, do whatever you want here. Server config error. This is the uh, edit the server config we already had. You can edit it over here. Uh, and yeah, diagnostics. So, this is the good part. You can see here your server stats version, like your SFX this, uh, artifacts version. Uh, your this is the DX hidden version, the server app time. Yeah, this is the server is not uh, online. Uh, I mean, not no one just joined, so it doesn't update this. Ban and ban and whitelist checking ban is uh enabled. Whitelisting is disabled. This is etc. Over here, uh, you can find your settings, the path, etc. So we go to the environment node is the uh, you don't need this you don't, you don't want to know that os you already know this is uh, self explanatory to be honest the rest is self explanatory you can understand it pretty easy 
uh, admin manager this is if you want to add other admins you put the uh, you were username like wherever you want here you can put wherever you want this it will be the you like the user's name the actual name so if we go on SFX forums and for example share search for Andy I think it's like this yeah it's like this search for Andy for example this is gonna be his his name the his uh, SFX ID so you add it over there and their discord ID uh, we don't show that, but it is fine. So you're gonna add the Discord ID, and you can check what permissions you want them to see, to use, etc. You save it. Ooh, I think I did a mistake. Yep. Uh, there is different. Uh, yeah. Now it's working. If you refresh, you'll find the username. Uh, whatever you want to set, you can change it anymore and it was set with the this user's id you can of course delete it here you go it's deleted uh next we're gonna do tx add log this is the logs all also in action this is the actions this is the console now we go to settings you can change the server name that's gonna be displayed in chat and discord message the uh, language now this is just change the server data folder copy path and force game build from here directly uh one thing each uh, i recommend on or restart is if it crashes and the or the server just restarted at the x admin start automatically quite mode is like not print ink the fx service output on the terminal uh is you can still use like the live console this but you can't output it nothing will over here will be output on the live console restarter this is the ch this is now in this non-temporary restart this is gonna be scheduled every day so for example if you go five uh in 10 minutes actually no 10 minutes actually yeah and disable announcements all right so you're still starting the time the limit is uh like uh it will wait for resources to load for how much this is the max uh you can put up to three minutes uh, and cars need this if you have a lot of cars like in one resource it will need to be set to three minutes at least and uh, it's of course depending on your server performance and hardware uh now we go to the schedule restarts it's exactly gonna use the 24 hour format you said here, for example, here this is gonna be in one hour. Actually, this is one hour. Uh, and yeah, now we go to disable announcement. This is and you see the announcement uh, box, a uh, yellow box, saying the date. I mean the uh, by server uh, server starting like announcement in how many minutes it will say. Uh, it's gonna be starting by 30 minutes, 20 minutes, etc. To reduce the uh, when the service is started. So if you want to enable, disable it. Do whatever you want here. So first of all, we're gonna enable it. Go to the dashboard, and we will see it doesn't say temporary anymore. And it says next restart in an hour. We can cancel it, but we're gonna only cancel this restart. It will still be re like next server restart. This will be set to normal. Or wherever this is passes, it will, for example, let's do the, something like this. If this this passes right now, it's doing to restart our mistakes. Let's do it at fourteen. Here, in a minute, you can cancel it. Oh, 
here it says right now restarting we can't split but it's just saying right now nothing is, is happening actually wait we wait a bit and it's gonna reset by itself and uh, it will restart in the next 24 hours now we finish up with the discord player manager this is to enable ban list to save the bands this is to enable whitelist uh, if you want to whitelist people you save her uh this is safe explaining this is to uh, uh this is the id of the person uh you're gonna whitelist it with uh the rest you can you can ex you understand by yourself yeah, everything else can be explained. Master actions, for example, here if you want to reset the server, reset the whole server. And this is if you want to back up the database, player's database. Here we can import bands from Easy Add in the menu in VRP, etc. Or ban SQL, which is like the SQL of where the bands are. This is if you want to clear the database uh, of your recent bands, gigs, etc. Anyways. Uh, thank you for uh, watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and understood more how to use TX admin and how to configure your server, uh, your FX server. So, if you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments. I will happily take them in consideration. And, uh, yeah, I have nothing else to say. Goodbye.